Look at me, 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 look at me now. Fuck, are you kidding me? You're my t Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. All right, well, he's one of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. It allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, it's over. most it's people over. believe, yeah, his opponent is in a it's world over, of trouble. All right, here he is for my money, Mike, the most well-rounded fighter in this division, a true mixed martial artist at his core, and he believes he'll have a lot of advantages in this matchup tonight. Everyone talked about him being well-rounded. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that can do everything across the board at such a high level. Yeah, he's comfortable wherever the fight goes. Maybe he'll grapple tonight, maybe he'll strike. Makes him a hard guy to prepare for. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Choi is seven years his senior. He will have a five-inch reach advantage. Now here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans, live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 144 pounds. Boom, boom. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 14 wins, four losses. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Busan, South Korea, the Korean Superboy, Du Ho Oh, all right, great to the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, come out fighting. difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus takes both. Oh, nice land there with the punch. You see, he's taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna set your body off. Nice defense there, huge block. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Right idea, wrong execution, no good on the left punch count. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Good punch lands. Oh, 
Oh, do you believe that another head kick lands? Got to start raising that guard or this is going to be the end of the fight. I mean, it's going to be the end of the fight. It's very surprising that he's even standing upright after taking such a bad shot. Just misses with the jab. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Nice sneaky head kick. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, and he caught the kick. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. And he landed the right hand there. Look at him whipping him into that kick. Punch is blocked. Oh, good combination. Big roundhouse now just misses. Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. And they separate. Well there to avoid the left hand coming back. I mean, he's cutting them down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. Big punch lands over the top. I was going to follow this one. Leg kick. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Come on, let's go. Your hands up. Let's go. Again, trying to set up that counter kick, but unable to find the target. Oh, nice. Big ball for punch land. Now he gets back in range. Well, he's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Nice job there to find a home for that jab. Got him whip his hip into that kick. So there it is, longer reach paying dividends as he counters with a punch. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, that's a nice strike. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, and he caught the kick. <laughs> Went for the inside leg kick. All right, here, final seconds of round one. Well, fortunate that one didn't land to the head. The hook shot blocked by Choi. Five minutes in the books. All right, so that's the end of the round. Potential adversity here. He's got a cut on his cheek sustained from that strike in the round. Now the focus becomes maximizing these 60 seconds, shutting that cut and preventing it from becoming a major factor here moving forward. All right, there's the end of the round. Not just execute that Superman punch, but to even attempt it. To even try it, you got to be really in your rhythm. Everything has to be going perfectly, as we saw in the lead-up to that attack. All right, here we go with round two. Round one, pretty good, not great, but some action on both sides. We can't always hope for fireworks, John. Yeah. Sometimes you got to deal with the ebb and flows of a fight. In round number one, you saw both guys have success. Let's see who really charges out ahead in the second round. Nice. Just a slip there. Oh, and he counters effectively with a jab upstairs there, DC. I know you don't often have the reach advantage, but nice to see him making good use of it in this matchup. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. 
He's looking to land the right just out of range. Choi gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Very nice leg kick there by Choi. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Big and kick. Now connects with a right. Counter jab snaps the head back. That should get his attention. Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside. Oh, man, head to land. That was stuck in. Nice strike. Doing a nice job putting it all together. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's in time. Over and over, he's landed these big body kicks. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Just missing on the counter there. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch him punch, I just put a smile on my face. Just misses with the straight left hand. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Punch coming, it's blocked. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Well, you gotta think he's gonna enjoy watching this one back tomorrow morning. He has landed a ton of significant strikes and really a guy who has been a monster in the gym finally putting it together during the office. To go home and admire you, to look at beauty in action, and he was the one causing all the action. Straight punch lands. Oh, he landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach and certainly is making it count in this one. Oh, left hook to the head, it's blocked. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come with me without a combo. I want the whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found the set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Beautiful strike. There's no give on that leg kick. Oh, big hook. That'll leave a mark. Nice kick. Oh, like the thought there. Good attempt at a counter. Ultimately, it's no good. 20 seconds left. Caught that. No, there's danger in that, too, because when you start reaching on to catch that kick, here comes the high kick, and then you're in a lot of trouble. Over and over again, what's he going to do to follow up? And that's the end of round number two. All right, so that's the end of the round. Pretty significant damage done in that round. Cut on the cheek, sustained there from that strike. Now the cut man's got to get in there and close that thing up. Better to be below the eye than above it, sure. But nonetheless, this could be a factor now moving forward. Well, what a round it was, and how about that flying Superman punch at the end of the round? Not a lot of fighters will try it. He did, he executed. And it worked, right? No discouragement from his opponent to make him not try it. Why not try it? It's working, so why not try it again? If his opponent isn't careful, he will get knocked out and be on the highlight reel for the rest of the time. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Great punch. 
huge block there. That was a thudding leg kick. Big hook. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Caught him flush with the head kick there, DC. Beautiful setup to get his leg up there quickly before his opponent could react. Oh, and he lands another punch there, and you can tell at this point he is going right at that cut on his opponent. Right at it. Keep your hands up, and when the hands go up, he will then change the target down low, trying to find finishes. So the taller fighter lands a huge flying knee there. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. Right hand upstairs. Pretty good right hand. As he gets close and he's out of the kicking range, he'll he'll change his stance. Nice leg kick land. Good punch. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Oh, big head kick. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. some body shots. Bounce, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Pretty significant well to the left side. Joy gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Oh, block the shot. Joy gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. Unable to connect with. He doesn't know if he's in the octagon or at his mama's house for Thanksgiving. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Knock him out. The fight's done. A sneaky head kick. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Back and forth we go. Big shot lands. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body. How good is that right hand? Just missing on the high kick there. Oh man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard, he kicks so hard every time you see him drive his shin into his opponent. Final seconds of round three. Head kick. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. All right, so a huge round for him there. His opponent will need Motrin tomorrow. A lot of head kicks in that previous five minutes. He took way too many head kicks. He was trying to go forward. He was trying to pressure. And when he was doing that, he was carrying his hands low. And his opponent was just wrapping that kick up and over the side of his guard. Credit to his opponent for finding this shot, but really bad on him for not really making the adjustment to stop it. 
All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. All right, so a good job defensively by him here as he raises the guard and prevents any damage. Shades of James Tony, always seeing things coming at him. Can't take many of those, you better check. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Great punch landed with so much power. Oh, caught him with the head kick. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Choi. Big kick lands. Slips the shot. Oh, Superman punch. Circling to his right. Choi's shot is blocked. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. There's no tell on that leg kick. Nice kick. Just misses with the jab there. We march on three minutes to go. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of locking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this. Big body kick. Just out of range with that right hand. Ooh, what a punch. They continue to exchange. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Choi. Nice loop and punch. Trying to establish that jab once again. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. All right, side control now. Well, you gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here, nice punch. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. Unable to connect with the right. Big, straight left. Oh, Superman punch is good. You can tell he's been working on that. Timing his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very accurate. Dude's oh. hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Back to the feet. Oh! Nice head kick. Joy gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Right hand upstairs. Horn sounds for the end of round four. All 
right, that's the end of five minutes. That's the end of the round. You see the cut on his lip, and that thing is only getting worse. Pretty nasty gash at this point in time. You know he's going to need some sutures after the fact. The focus right now, though, keeping his head in the game. Don't think about the cut. You got to think about getting your offense going and shoring up that defense to prevent that cut from getting any worse. So here it is, folks, fifth and final round. Nice leg kick. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Swing and a miss by the Korean Super Bowl. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Oh, the Superman punch lands. Way to hide that leg kick. Blocks the shot. Just misses with a left hook there. What a punch. Big leg kick land. Nice one, two there. Nice. Beautiful leg kick throw. Counter jab, snaps the head back. That'll get his attention. Well, he continues to find it. This fight's gonna be over. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent, thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. Big leg kick land. On the fight. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Out of range with that one. He blocks the punch. He's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Keep it busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. I love watching this guy move on the ground. Another nice transition there. Such a high level grappler. You don't see that very often. Choi's right back to the full mount. Two minutes now to go in this one. Just punch over the top. Right under the elbow, the body keep playing. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Joy's punch to the body is blocked, so no damage done there. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Oh, nice. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Under a minute now to go in the fight. Five seconds remain in the round. Big kick land. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Tags him with the uppercut. He's got to start moving his head. He cannot take this many shots to the head. 
Oh, uppercut will snap the head back. Nice counter. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. It's a beautiful fast foot jab with beating. Beautiful kick. What a 15 minutes put forth. All right, so a lot to like over the distance of that fight tonight. Clearly, we think we saw one guy win the fight and largely got it done with the striking. Yeah, he got it done with the striking. And that's exactly what he's known for. And that showed tonight as he truly outworked his opponent. <laughs> Official decision now in. The buff has it. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest. 48-47. The winner by unanimous decision, the Korean Super Bowl, Duho Chong. All right, congratulations to him. He is your winner by unanimous decision and certainly a dominant performance here tonight. Yeah, he did a great job of just dictating and controlling all the engagements of this fight.